Hi everyone, can you tell from the smile on my face what kind of day it is? Well, let me give you a hint. Well, it's just another Timu Tuesday. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. To my subscribers, thank you guys so much. It means the world to me that you're able to take a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you're new to my channel, I hope that you take a quick second. Hit that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join us for future videos. Today we are doing Timu Hall number 39. I know how crazy crazy is that so anyway I've got a Timu wig on I've got a Timu blazer on I've got a Timu turtleneck on I have Timu rigs on I know so anyway it's just a really fun experience um shopping is just really really fun there prices are so so good and uh, yeah I'm just having a blast doing Timu hauls. Um, I have slowed down quite a bit. I've just, I've just got too much stuff. You know, I could get back to my thing of you bring something in, something goes out. So yeah, I've got some major decluttering to do. I did a couple of boxes to the DAV in the spring, and I did some in the summer, and I just did another six boxes. But I've got more to go. So anyway, that said. I really appreciate when you take your time and you get a chance to write it in a comment or leave an emoji. Just say hi. Just let me know that you've been here. It really means a lot. And, of course, that helps with the analytics or whatever it is. The There's a word for it. It'll come to me probably tonight when I'm sleeping. I'm going to wake up and say, that's the word I was thinking of. And, of course, um, giving these videos like the just really helps. Um, YouTube put our channels out there more so that more people can see us we get to meet some more people and just it just creates a lot of fun in our lives just getting to meet so many wonderful people and I appreciate all of you so much alrighty so team number 39 I'm going to try to keep it short because I don't know if my voice is going to cut out again I've got my hey girl feel better tea over here so let's get into it first thing I want to show you it's a hat. You know, I love hats. Never thought I would like... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Never thought I would be a hat per hat person. But you know what? I am. So I got this cute little hat here. And it's Hound's Tooth. It's like a little cowboy hat or cowgirl hat. So anyway, this was $7.48. I did get two price reductions on it that totaled $0.74. Cents. So my final cost was $6.74. Doesn't go with this outfit, but you know what? I think I probably have something that does. So anyway, got a hair in my eye. But anyway, so I just love this hat. I think it's going to be a lot of fun to wear. I got two purses or pocketbooks or handbags or yeah, I don't know what everybody calls them these days. I always call them pocketbooks. So I got the same one in black and the one in this kind of caramel color, like a butterscotch. So these are both the same. They're supposed to be this faux reptile print. I don't know if you can see it. We got the shiny patent leather. We got little tootsies on the bottom. We got a little zipper right here that doesn't really go that deep really tight to get into but it would be enough to put in maybe credit card your driver's license maybe a spare key or something like that in case the garage door opening doesn't work when you get home always handy to have a spare right so anyway we got that here we've got these little handles right here it does have these little rings on the side to put in put on the shoulder strap yeah so i'll show you more on the caramel colored ones because i think this one might show the detail a little bit more. Then, of course, we got that same kind of patent leather right there with the name on it. We've got these 
little faux zippers right here. The zippers do go up and down, but there's no space in it. This one was missing this little tag right here. But for the money, I'm not going to really worry too much about it. I still have the plastic on. You know, I got this back in September, and I just haven't had a chance to do it. It's got a zipper along the top right here. And it opens up like this. There's a strap to put on for the shoulder bag. It's got a center compartment right here that zips. We've got these two pockets on the side. And on this side, we've got a zipper right here. That I think I just closed it. I've got a zipper right, right here. And your hand goes in. So this is enough to put like some emergency Kleenexes and maybe a couple of dollars or whatever you need to carry in there. And just a small bag. You're not going to be able to fit, you know, your apartment or anything in here. But a few necessary supplies. These were both $15.28 each. Um, they did have two price reductions that were the same. That totaled $3.23 each. So the final cost on both these pocketbooks handbags were twelve dollars and five cents alrighty so then I got two jackets could be like outerwear so this first one it's a hound's tooth to go with the hat I know how crazy is that so it's not lined or anything so I'm um, I'm either going to have to dig out my sewing machine to kind of sew this down to tack down this facing because that just wants to keep coming out or get some of that fusible stuff that you're just dying on so anyway it's not lined or anything but it's just a lightweight jacket just to maybe wear around the house uh, it's got long sleeves and it's got just a button detail on both sides right there and that was ten dollars and eighty four cents and i didn't get any price reductions on that <clears throat> Sorry about that. The other one is kind of feels like that kind of microfiber, like a suede or something. And this is in that kind of caramel color. I know. Did I plan that or what? So anyway, this is machine wash and dryable. It's got the zipper down the front. It's got two faux pockets. Long sleeve. It's got that kind of detail right here sewn in to help maybe give you a little bit of shape. And this was... $12.59. So this would be like a good lightweight jacket too. Spring, early fall, cool summer night or something like that. Go nice over a pair of jeans or trousers. I'm going to take some tea and I will be right back. Alrighty, sorry about that. So anyway, I just thought it would be a nice a little jacket. And I thought it would be nice for early fall when I ordered it. I haven't worn it yet, but really got anywhere to wear it so anyway I got this and again that one was twelve dollars and fifty nine cents and for Christmas when Raina was here they gave me this Vince Camuto scarf set with his hat with a pom-pom and I was thinking that should go very nice so anyway I am going to try this on and I will be right back Alrighty, so I'm back. I just left the same turtleneck on. I put on a Swarovski necklace. I couldn't figure out what to wear. I almost grabbed the pearls, but grab that instead. It does need to definitely be tacked down here, whether I, like I said, take out my sewing machine from downstairs or just get that iron on fusing. That's probably what I'll do. That would probably be the quickest way to fix that problem. But anyway, it's a nice length. It um, just goes down right ar around a little below my hips. Okay, we got those buttons right here for a little bit of detail. If I lose a few pounds, it'll look a little bit better. And when I tack that down, it'll be perfect. So anyway, and I think it goes okay with the hat. They're different sizes, but I think it still looks okay. And with a black little pocketbook. Alrighty, so let's go try on that other one. And I will be right back. Alrighty, so I am back. I'm ready for a cool fall night. Just maybe getting into winter when it's not so cold yet. This outfit, the hat, the scarf, the Vince Camuto scarf from Raina and Family goes perfectly with this. But anyway, so let's show you the look. Let's hold up the pocketbook. I did put the crossbody strap on. There is 
plenty of room here to make it a cross body but for now I will just put it on my shoulder to show you what it looks like it's a fun little handbag or pocketbook and this does zipper up sleeves along I just kind of folded it up shows the underside a little bit and in case it's cold I can go like this and let's undo the scarf it does have the zipper right here and again, just I uh, left the same turtleneck on, just changed out the jewelry. So anyway, just I'm ready for a cool fall night or, you know, and then of course you could always take the scarf off so it doesn't look like winter time. But anyway, I think this was a fun haul from Timu for number 39. I'm so glad that you guys were here to join me. And as you can see, we have this behind me again. So I just want to give a little shout out to the giveaway that we have going on for the ugly Christmas sweater. So this is the little card we made for it. Now that's ugly for the 2023 ugly Christmas sweater winner that you guys are going to vote on for me. And then we'll have that giveaway that's going to be closing. Well, I already forgot my date said it's closing, but you guys remember, right? But anyway, I'll have the video up there going to have all the details in it this is going to be one of the little prizes that are going to be in there and this is from the crackerology we actually got a small box of just the crackers in one of my vinyl boxes and then i went online and found they had some fun little kits so i ordered some for myself enjoyed them so much i thought i would share with you guys these are like a smaller version of those little kits it comes with four so we've got the jalapeno and chipotle, the red wine and rosemary, sweet s'moreology, and the ready for confetti. So just a full fun little thing. Maybe some night just make a little charcuterie board with these and do it all at once or just different times. So on this one, say for example, the jalapeno and chipotle, it's everything you need in the kit. So you got crackers, cheese, salami, spicy mustard and sriracha i think i'm gonna have to get one of these for myself that sounds really really good the red wine and rosemary it includes the crackers cheese and preserves so it looks like you get some kind of cream cheese there and some kind of uh jam to put on top so that should be a good little treat the ready for confetti so this has cookies, icing, preserves, and sprinkles. So just a fun little dessert snack cookie. And the last one is Sweet S'morology. So this one has cookies, chocolate hazelnut, and mini marshmallows. So we'll have that and then just some other things to fill up the box. I don't think this is going to get longer than I thought. So I will come up with another box to ship it in. It might fit in one of the, uh, the longer boxes. And then whatever I can find to fill up the box so it doesn't get lonely. So anyway, we will have that giveaway going on. Again, the details will be in that video that I attach up there. So good luck, everybody. And I hope you pick a fun, ugly Christmas sweater for me. So anyway, I want to thank you guys again for taking a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means so much to me. I hope everyone goes out, has a fabulous, fabulous day. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. I'm thinking I'm going to cough and I'm trying to get it out before I start coughing. So take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. Love you guys so much. And I can't wait to see you in our next video. Bye-bye.